How's it going everyone and welcome back to LT3D. Flashforge has released three new printers this year. The Adventurer 4 Pro, the Adventurer 3 Pro version 2, and the Guider 3 Ultra. However, they're not done yet. Flashforge has just teased another new 3D printer. This image was posted in the official Flashforge Facebook group on August 11th. Now considering that Flashforge's last three printers have all been about speed, is this new printer going to be their Bamboo Lab competitor? I kinda hope so. Let's talk about it. Flashforge is a well-known brand in the 3D printing scene that has been producing reliable printers such as the Creator Pro, Guided 2S and recently the highly popular Adventurer 4 since 2014. Their printers produce great results and are fairly easy to maintain, however, they've always printed kinda slow. Now since Bamboo Lab has come along with their high speed, high quality printers and taken the 3D printing world by storm, it's only a matter of time before we see Flashforge come to the table with their own high speed 3D printers. Other 3D printed brands such as Elegoo and Creality have already done so with their Elegoo Neptune 4 and their Creality K1 and K1 Max. The first step Flashforge has taken is releasing high speed nozzles on their new Adventurer 3 Pro version 2 and Adventurer 4 Pro. This doubles their speed with the Adventurer 4 Pro now having a default print speed of 200 mils per second and a max print speed of 300 mils per second. Now, this isn't 500 mils per second, but it's a good starting point. The name of the new printer has been announced as the Flashforge Adventure 5M Pro, and this is what's got me thinking that Flashforge might be releasing either a Bamboo Lab clone or a new competitor printer. And I kinda hope they do. Okay guys, so I uh, edited Mateo here. While I was editing this video, someone has released images of the printers in the Flashforge group. Yep, that's right, printers. Flashforge is releasing not one, but two new 3D printers. And um, from what I'm about to show you, I think it's safe to say that I was pretty spot on with my prediction. The new Adventure 5M looks very similar to a Bamboo Lab P1P. And I mean very, very similar. <laughs> By the looks of it though, it does have a better screen than the P1P, which has me interested. Now they haven't released any official specs or anything for the printers, however they did start a competition in the Facebook group where you can win some filament if you guess the feature of the new printers. So I'll pop the winner's comments on the screen now for you and uh, we'll have a look at what potentially might be the specs of the new printer. Well, printers. So it's not confirmed, but it looks like the 5M Pro will be priced around 1,099 to 1,199 Australian dollars, have a core XY structure with a max print speed of 600 mils per second, a PEI build plate, built-in camera, auto bed leveling, around 300 degree nozzle temp, uh, and around 200 cubed to 300 cubed build size. So definitely in the ballpark of the Bamboo Lab X1 Carbon. In regards to the Venture 5M, we don't know a lot about the specs, apart from the fact that it's an open design, meaning you probably won't be able to print ABS, ASA, or other engineering filaments. These printers have got me very excited, and if they're anything like previous Flashforge 3D printers, then the quality is going to be fantastic, and with the high speeds, it's definitely going to be a Bamboo Lab competitor. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on these new printers and whether you're excited for them. Uh, and as always, happy printing.